They say never say never. I say never tell me what to do. A person will never put you in a position above them. That's never a lie. Always true. Success never comes without risk and risk never comes without fear. YouTube is a smoking mirror. Never how it appear. Hey, what up? It's your boy Icewater815 coming back at you with another video. And in this video, I'm going to give y'all what y'all been waiting on, man. Y'all been waiting on the Amazon video. I got a lot of email requests to do it. A lot of people asking me when I was going to talk about Amazon. What's up with Amazon? So you want to hear, here it go. But first, before I get into Amazon, let me say this. I know a lot of people when I first started pulling Amazon freight, they was like, man, Amazon messing up the spot market because they doing this, they doing that. I strongly disagree. Those people who say Amazon is affecting trucking. Honestly, they have no idea what they're talking about. Amazon moving their own freight. They ain't got nothing to do with the spot market. And in fact, they probably taking trucks out of the spot market. So that means that if you know about supply and demand or understand the logistics of trucking, Amazon opening up their own little low board, their own little logistics network is what I'm going to call it will help the spot market out. But I don't argue with people no more. I just listen to them and I keep it moving. So with that being said, if you haven't checked out my first Amazon video, I'm going to put a link to it up here somewhere. I ain't 100% sure where, but it'll be somewhere. You can click on that, check that out. Today, what I want to talk about is just the Amazon Relay, the app that Amazon has for, I'm going to just say single truck operations because I don't want to get ahead of myself. There's some more videos where we're going to dig into some other things, but Right now, let's just talk about the Relay app, and I'll put a picture up of what the Relay app look like probably right there, I hope. So let's get right to it, man. Amazon Relay app, and this after me, been, I've been dealing with Amazon for maybe a year and a half, maybe. I, I ain't quite sure when I started, but back around when I shot that one video. So anyway, let's, let's just jump right to it. It's, I only came up with like seven things to tell y'all about because I think th these things are probably the most important and I don't want the video to be that long because I ain't got a long attention span no way. So with no further ado, let's get to it. The First, we gonna, what I like about the app, we're going to do that first. Then we're going to talk about what I don't like about it. Then we're going to get into something else, but other videos. So the Relay app, the first thing I like is you can see the price and you can book the load right then. When you see the price, I mean, pretty much you want the load, you accept the load, you assign a driver to it, it's your load. The next thing that I like about the Amazon Relay app or Amazon as a whole is they power only loads and most of them are round trip. Now, they have added live loads and live unloads where you bring your own trailer, but I really like the power only loads. I think that that's kind of. For me, that's where the money at, you know what I mean, with the rates that they're giving out. But shh, we're going to talk about the rates in a whole nother video. I, another thing I like about Amazon as far as the Relay app is they don't charge to pay you. So I'm not going to exactly call it quick pay because I like to call quick pay like 24 to 48 hours. But they don't charge you a fee to get your money. So I'm going to call it free payment. And their work week runs from, or let's just say their pay week runs from Sunday to Saturday. And with that being said, you be paid on the following Friday. You feel me? So free payment. The next thing that I like about Amazon as far as the running the relay freight or whatever is it's all light loads. None of the Amazon loads are heavy. So if you're worried about MPG or anything like that, it's not a lot of wear and tear on your truck and you'll get good MPG if you can stay off the accelerator. Another thing I like about Amazon is their, their dry vans that you're pulling, they got fairly decent equipment. When I first started, they had some really nice equipment, but of course, Drivers have abused the equipment over time, so you might get a trailer here that pull a little bit of pull a little bit funny, or mm, yeah, we just gonna leave it at that. You know how it go when you getting trailers, everybody pulling different trailers, so they are not really taking care of it and staying up on the maintenance like they should. But for the most part, for a power only program that I've dealt with, they got some decent equipment, and their equipment was newer at one time, so it is what it is. 
Another thing I like about the Relay program is you could go right on the Relay app, rather. You could go right on the app and report delays, whether it's traffic, whether it's weather, and you can give them an estimated time of arrival. And this is important because Amazon kind of scores you on your performance. So long as you're using this app and you adjusting the times or you're reporting the delays, it's not going to count against you. If you don't use the app and you get delays or you show up late for something, then it will count against you. And the last thing I'm going to say about the Amazon Relay program is they give you ample amount of time to get the load there. It's not one of them things where you have to rush and get the load there. They give you more than a legal amount of time to get the load there. So those are like the seven things that I think are important for people to know about the Amazon Relay program and for the one truck operation primarily how you gonna get freight if you're a one truck operation the amazon relay app and the relay board is primarily how you're going to get your freight and like i said we're gonna dig deeper into this this is just the first video about the amazon thing so this the good i'll do a video about the bad and i'll do a video about the ugly because it kind of get deep when you're dealing with amazon and i don't think a lot of people really understand how to interact with Amazon, like the do's, the don'ts, or what is actually required. So I'll be kicking those videos out as time permit. Hey, look, this your boy Icewater 815, man. You got any questions about the Amazon freight or whatever, just drop it in the comment section and I'll be sure to uh, get back to you. So, hey, remember, it don't matter what type of truck you drive, as long as it'll deliver a load. But you ain't going to make no money in trucking if you can't keep that left door closed. Hey, I'll see y'all next video. Be safe. Been through a lot of pain in my life and I pray the Lord take it all away.